see my shadow. This is wisdom which man must learn. Good evening, one and all. Revered Chief Guest of the Day, Dr. Suman Manjuri, retired IPS officer, ex-Inspector General of Police, Guest of Honor, Ms. Kavita Dvivedi, renowned Odyssey dancer, Mr. Ashok Pratap Singh, sir, mentor, advisor, and former president, Board of Trustees, Modern School, Ms. Anuradha Singh, president, Board of Trustees, Modern School, distinguished trustees and promoters of Platinum Education Trust, principals of various modern schools, eminent Rotarians, other dignitaries and parents. On this special day, that will be the glorious landmark in the history of the modern school ECNCR, I extend a very warm welcome to you all to the grand celebrations of the annual day of our school. My heartiest greetings to all who consented to share every moment of this wonderful evening with us today. The light is a hymn of life. Today, as we light the inaugural lamp, we pray that we are ever guided on the path that leads to glorious heights of success and the selfless light dispels darkness. May I request our respected principal ma'am, Ms. Abba Sadana, to kindly escort our honorable guest for the lamp lighting ceremony. I request all the honorable guests to kindly come forward for the lamp lighting ceremony. Dr. Suman Manjari, retired IPS officer, ex Inspector General of Police, guest of honor, Ms. Kavita Dvivedi, renowned Odissi dancer, Ms. Anuradha Singh, President, Board of Trustees, Modern School, Mr. Ashok Pratap Singh, sir, advisor and former President, Board of Trustees, Modern School. Mr. Ajay Goyal, our distinguished trustee and promoter of Platinum Education Trust.
IPS officer, ex-inspector general of police, presently working as a jury member of the juvenile justice board Sonipat. I request our honorable principal Ms. Abba Sadana to kindly felicitate Dr. Suman Manjuri, our chief guest of the day, to express a profound love and gratitude. Ma'am, we feel honored that you spared your valuable time to grace us with your august presence here this evening. We welcome you, ma'am. A gracious welcome to our guest of honor, Ms. Kavita Dvivedi, renowned Odyssey dancer. We felicitate ma'am, according her a floral welcome. An outstanding dancer as well as choreographer, a versatile artist, Ma'am has been honored with various awards and is the founder director of Century Foundation Delhi. We are honored with your presence here today, Ma'am. We welcome you, Ma'am. We accord a genial welcome to Ms. Anuradha Singh, President, Board of Trustees, Modern School. I request ma'am to kindly felicitate Mrs. Anuradha Singh with a token of love and gratitude. Ma'am, your being here is a source of inspiration for us all. We welcome you ma'am. We graciously welcome Mr. Ashok Pratap Singh, sir, mentor, advisor, and former president, Board of Trustees, Modern School. We felicitate, sir, a dynamic leader and her mentor. His gracious presence always motivates us. We welcome you, sir. We accord a genial welcome to our distinguished trustees. We are thankful for your gracious presence this evening, sir. We felicitate our distinguished trustees and promoters of the Platinum Education Trust. We welcome wholeheartedly principals of various modern schools, distinguished guests, other dignitaries. We thank all of you for gracing the occasion with your presence here today. And now I request and invite our Honorable Principal, Ms. Abba Sadana, to accord a formal welcome to our revered guests and present the school report that will give you an insight into the accomplishments of the past year and a glimpse of the journey ahead.
हाँ जी पोडियम का माइक ऑन है थैंक यू वेरी मच वेल गुड इवनिंग लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन अ वेरी हार्टी वेलकम टू आवर एनुअल डे सेलिब्रेशन इट इज अ डे वेन वी इंट्रोस्पेक्ट ऑन आवर पास्ट एंड टेक प्राइड इन शेयरिंग विद यू द एक्ट्स एंड माइल स्टोन एकम्पलिश बाई आवर स्टूडेंट्स एंड स्टाफ इन अकेडमिक्स एंड अदर फील्ड before i do so i welcome our revered chief guest ips retired dr suman manjiri lady with a dynamic personality and an inspiring aura the police medal awardee ma'am retired as inspector general of police thank you for taking out time to be with us ma'am it is my extreme delight to welcome our guest of honor and that is mrs kavita dwibedi one of the finest and most outstanding exponents of odissi dancer in india today i welcome mr ashok pratap singh mentor advisor and former president board of trustees modern school thank you for being with us always sir i am elated to welcome mrs anuradha singh president board of trustees modern school an inspiration and guiding light for all of us thank you ma'am for taking out your valuable time today for this evening i extend a whole hearted welcome to promoters and trustees of platinum education trust principal dr datta and other principals from other schools our neighboring schools distinguished guests parents and dear students i thank everyone for their unwavering support and belief in the school's philosophy and goals we are not just aiming to create academically sound students but new age learners and leaders of a brighter tomorrow as you are aware the aim of our school is to provide students a strong foundation of knowledge and life skills for success in life many initiatives have been undertaken in the school in the last 2 years and the, to highlight the following are a few during covid when we all were locked in our homes and houses the school took an initiative to give wings to the children's imagination by organizing inter school quarantine coach a virtual artistic talent contest where more than 3000 entries from 300 plus schools not only in india but abroad were received a virtual live event giggle gala was organized for the vivacious pre primary school students in the age group of 2 and a half to 5 years an event that garnered an overwhelming response of over 400 participants we invited schools from across the country on a virtual platform for the first ever set of inter school digital it competition innovision 2020 an it festival to celebrate the emerging era of technology and digitalization wherein more than 25 schools from delhi ncr and other states participated zealously to make the learning of students more effective the primary co curricular department created and shared more than 750 videos related to subject specific concepts music dance sports life skills etc that ensured in cementing the concepts that have been covered virtually and students could revise the concepts at their own pace sports and games were given prime importance in school even during lockdown period we hosted inter school roller skating championship in 201920 where in more than 250 students from delhi ncr participated under the theme stay fit don't quit an online friendly chess tournament was hosted in 2020 
wherein more than 300 players from across the country participated with vigor. A webinar, Kam Yoga session was conducted in association with PEFI in 2021, wherein the students and parents enjoyed participating and felt motivated to make yoga a vital part of their life. We left no stone unturned for our students to help them to choose different course options for their future in the renowned universities across the world. South Asia webinar, psychometric analysis, and many, many more sessions were organized to guide them in their career path after school. Crowdfunding is a life skill that helps to build empathy and teach students to make the world a better place. I proudly announce that students of classes S4 to S7 raised more than 4 lakh rupees through this project and provided back to school kits prepared sustainably for school kids of rural Uttar Pradesh. Aira Dalpatya of S4 raised the maximum amount of rupees 37,800 in a matter of three days. It is with great elation and pride I share with you that 20% of our class 12 students got admission in various renowned foreign universities in the last two years. And five of them bagged impressive scholarships and proved their mettle as a true blue modernite. The school organized an intra-school model United Nations, an extremely enriching and empowering event that inspired the students to become the future youth leaders, to participate in endeavors that enhance their skills and lead to their holistic development. For work experience and learning pertaining to varied interests of our students, 12 work education clubs for classes P3 to S7 have been introduced. To name a few, TechWiz, Robotics, IoT, Entrepreneurship, Kalakriti, Abhyanshala, and many more. Most of the parents, now when we are going to go for the exhibition soon after the event, you'll be able to have the glimpse of the amazing work done by your children over there. Special weeks were celebrated in classes nursery to P2, inculcate habits and values among students with the aim of widening the horizons of the tiny tots. Mythological week, health and environment week, cleanliness week, etc. gave a great platform to our inquisitive minds to explore and excel. Early morning sports classes have been reinitiated for various team and individual games, wherein students are getting coaching from national level players. I could see about 200 students, they enrolled themselves to come at 6.30 in the morning for these classes. But the, now the number is dwindling down. I can understand because of the winter and you can say the late day starting. But I hope once this phase is over, my kiddos are going to be back on the field. Inauguration of the most awaited cricket academy took place this year, thus giving a stellar opportunity to our budding cricketers to enhance their skills and shine. The differently abled Cricket Association of Haryana conducted the Vyang Premier League in the school premises. Taking one more leap ahead on this significant day, Sports, Sports Ability Academy has been inaugurated today by Dr. Vijay Datta, Mrs. Singh, and all other dignitaries. It is another milestone in our journey and a way of re returning back to the society. I would like to share and mention the academic achievements of class 10 and class 12 students of the session 21-22. School achieved 
100% result for classes S5 and S7 in CBSC board exam like every year. Our school toppers were Dhruv Soni in class 10, bagged 96.2% marks. Japkirat Singh of class 12 got 96.6% in class 12. Our students made us proud by scoring 100% in different subjects. For example, Dhruv Soni scored 100% in mathematics, Japkirat 100% in psychology, Manav Arora, Arab Energy scored 100% in business studies. I think they deserve a bigger hand. Thank you. Our students participated in Olympiads in different subjects in these two years. They won 99 gold, 34 silver, 36 bronze, and 27 medals of distinction. The success of our students in sports bears testimony to the school's endeavor to encourage sporting talent and provide a platform for growth and learning. At this juncture, I am ecstatic to recall our remarkable year of April 29, 2019 till November 22, wherein the school won. You hear it. 184 gold, 158 silver, 128 bronze medals, and 13 trophies in numerous sports and competitions. Now, I would like to ask Vismay Anup, our junior head boy, and Adrita Nandi, senior head girl, to outline the specific achievements of the school in various fields. Thank you, ma'am. Good evening, everyone. It is an honor for me to run through the list of achievements of our prestigious school. To begin with, I would like to acknowledge all my friends who have made us proud in the sports competitions at the inter-school level. The training of our champions begin as early as the tender years of nursery and they create magic on wheels by the sheer display of their technique and finesse on skates. The school participated in five inter-school events and won a total of 26 gold, 14 silver, 8 bronze medals as well as 2 trophies in various roller skating championships. Taekwondo, the martial art, is also taught from class nursery onwards. We participated in five inter-school Taekwondo championships held in and around Delhi NCR and bagged eight gold, 14 silver, and 14 bronze medals, as well as a trophy. Now, let us move on to team sports a game that brings the nation together as one. Yes, the game of cricket. We hosted the Intermodern Cricket Tournament, wherein the teams competed for the coveted trophy, showcasing talent, grit, and zeal. Arav Gaba of Class S1 was awarded Man of the Match. Viren Chadda of Class P5 was the best fielder of the tournament, and Suvit Kamboj of Class S2 was the best batsman. The school bagged second position in the tournament. In basketball, in the East Delhi Sports Series 2022, the school participated in the championship in the under 14 and under 17 age groups and bagged gold medals in their respective categories. Harman Singh Bedi of Class S4 and Daksh Vaswani of Class S2 were the top scorers. Our under-14 basketball team bagged a bronze medal in the inter-school competition held at GD Goenka School, making us proud with the achievements. Our sportspersons competed in CBSC and SGFI at the district, state and zonal levels this year. Many have qualified for the national level games, which are to be held 
very soon. Kavish of class P5 made the school proud by winning a silver medal in the first India Skate Game Skating Championship at the national level in Mohali. Dia Malik of P3 and Sharanya of S7 bagged gold medals in the 59th Haryana Roller Skating Championship and are all ready for the National Roller Skating Championship. Rolling the wheels with hockey in their hands, Dak Sharma, Trimanveer Singh and Kabir Gupta of Class P4 bagged gold medals at the District Level Roller Skating Hockey Championship 22-23, wherein Trimanveer Singh also got selected for the Haryana State Skating Championship. Akshita Singh and Nitya Parashar of Class S2 won silver and gold medals respectively. Ronika Goyal and Saisha Sahani of Class S1 won gold and silver medals respectively in the SGFI District Skating Championship and are selected for the Haryana State Skating Championship. Sarveen of Class P1 bagged a silver medal. Naira of Class P2 bagged a bronze medal. And Ashvi of Class P2 bagged one silver medal and a bronze medal in the 59th Haryana Roller Skating Championship organized by the Roller Skating Federation of India. Ace Taekwondo champion Anubhadadwarj of Class S5 won a bronze medal in the SGFI Taekwondo Championship. Our school participated in the Noida Open National Taekwondo Championship, wherein they bagged one gold medal, five silver medals, and eight bronze medals in the sub-junior freshers age group. With precision and speed, our young Leah Sharma of Class S2 has been selected for the Haryana SGFI state level for netball. Maulik Bansal and Shivain Bhatnagar of Class S3 made the school proud with their selection in the Under-14 State Cricket Tournament. Hitting boundaries with fervor and strength, Jasmine Kaur of Class S4 and Sehaj Kaur of Class S1 made a mark with their selection in the Under-17 Girls State Cricket Tournament. Football is yet another sport which added a feather in our cap. Football, the football team of the school participated in the under-14 girls and boys category. We also had the privilege of hosting the Inter-School Taekwondo Championship, wherein more than 200 students from diff 16 different schools across Delhi and Sia showcased their skills and the school bagged 12 gold, 9 silver, 3 bronze and the winner's trophy. Achievements are many and the list is long. Now, I would like to request Adrita Nandi to enumerate some more success stories in other fields. Thank you, everyone. Good evening, everyone. While our sports stars have achieved great heights, our artists have also left a mark with their creativity and imagination. In Pehchan, National Rangoli Making Competition 2022, achievements of our young artists are as follows. The first position was backed by Ayushman Khurana of S2 and Zoya of S5. The second position was backed by Mehranj of P5, Suhani of S5, Dimpika Mittal of S3 and the third position was backed by Anya Goswami of S2 and Surmai of S1. Exhibiting their talent on the theme, Indian Wildlife, 11 students from classes P2 to S3 of the school participated in Pehchan 5th National Level Painting Competition 2022. Sifat Khurana of class P3 won the first position. Ishna of class P5 got the second position and Yashmit of class S1 got the third position and Gurbani Khurana of S1 got a special mention award. Riday Harora of class S1 made the school proud by securing the first position in the junior category in inter-school painting competition organized by the Hindustan Times at Kiran Nadar Museum of Art. 
in the intermodern on the spot painting and sculpture competition meher bindra of class s7 won the second position in the event we all know that education is not restricted to books given a window of opportunity the genius in each and every child flourishes the tech savvy students of the school made us proud by excelling in an inter school computer competition ignite 2022 by winning coveted awards and trophy wherein amber of class p3 kabir gupta of class p4 backed the first position adya khatter of class s4 and ayan gupta of class s5 won the third position and arya chauhan of class s2 saina kapoor of class s3 bagged the appreciation for good efforts science begins with wonder scientific temperament and rational thinking the school participated in the international virtual science exhibition 2022 to 23 organized by avval all india young scholars Mehranj Saini of class P5 demonstrated the magic ink experiment and backed the first position in the exhibition. And Riana Nagpal of class P5 showcased the idea of magical potion and backed the third position. The modernites made the school proud by winning the third position in an inter-school science competition at the modern school Vasant Vihar in two events. The students are Sirat and Trimanveer of class P4, Inaya of P5 and Radhya of P5 and Anisha Golani and Adil Shamim of class S6. Fostering the sense of inspiration, creativity and innovation and teamwork, students from class S1 to S6 participated in STEAM, Science, Technology, Engineering, Arts and Mathematics events of 2022 wherein the team comprising of Arya Chauhan, Anhad Batra, Pragyan and Nandini of class S2 and Barminder of class S1 won the third position in group 1. Competition teaches us vast lessons. It drives us to be the best we can be. Eight students of our school from classes P4 to S6 participated in the inter-modern English debate competition held at the modern school Vasant Vihar. Bismay Anup of class P5 from the junior category won the third position as the speaker. Barminder class of uh, Barminder core of class S1 from the middle school category won the third position as the speaker. And Athar Vats from class S3 from the middle school category won the third position as the interjector. Prakrit of class S3 made the school proud by winning the consolation prize in verse slam. confidently reciting poetry with eloquence the tiny tots of classes nursery and kg akrit chopra and manya singh of class nursery mayra garg nak sharma and tiana singhal of class kg participated in an inter school competition chrysalis organized by the gems international school gurugram and backed exemplary performance award in various events related to art sports speaking and dance the modern school ecncr left its imprints in many inter school literary and cultural festivals during the literary fest held at the gateway international school sonipat students of classes p1 to s7 backed the first position in six events the second position in four events and the third position in five events Performing and visual arts give flight to one's imagination and spirit. Jhankar, an inter-school cultural event, was organized by the Cultural Society of our school. About 70 students from different schools participated in the vocal music, instrumental music, and classical dance competitions. Our school won four gold, three bronze, and four jury awards in the event. Apart from striving to attain exemplary academic standards, the school believes in grooming every facet of a student's personality. Our students have made a mark with their zealous participation in co-scholastic competitions and activities, such as talent hunt, declamations, debates, painting competitions, and so on. Students also participated in varied competitions like the English extempore, fancy dress, 
into house classical dance and many more which definitely helped in their holistic development. Our world is said to be a global village where we all are a part of one single family. With the same thought process, the school organized a virtual Indo-German exchange program, not just to provide exposure for self-development, but also to help the students to become global citizens, ready to adjust and adapt. To make senior secondary students aware about the multifarious career opportunities, various courses and admission processes, the school organized various campus visits to universities like OP Jindal University, Ashoka University and IIT Delhi. A team of 34 students participated in Model United Nations organized at the Rishihod University, Sonipat. Out of more than 200 delegates that participated in the event, our students won the award for the best school delegation. The school organized various educational excursions and trips to provide hands-on learning experience to the students such as the visit to Traffic Park, High Court, Science Museum, etc. Modernites also went for various educational trips to name a few, Jaipur, the Pink City, Nainital, Chel, Agra and many more. Following the motto of Rotary Club, the intra club of the school zealously worked towards the SD goals by organizing projects like Message for Life, which focused on disseminating verified information regarding the COVID essentials, contributing for the noble cause by providing underprivileged people of the society to the NGO Goonj and blood donation camp in the school. A session was hosted by the club on parental concerns and managing academic problem in children for parents and teachers. Pan India, wherein the speaker was Dr. V. S. Ravindran, to teach basic life skills. The Intra Club organized special workshops on problem solving skills, good touch and bad touch, soft skills, personality development, etc. The capacity to learn is a gift. The ability to learn is a skill, and the willingness to learn is a choice. Our teachers attended around 90 different workshop skills to understand the upcoming changes as per the new education policy. Our principal ma'am attended the school leaders conference in Phuket, Thailand, on the theme of Future of Education and Skilling in India. The conference was organized by Goethe Institute of Germany, and MAM was also a part of dual vocational education and training program in Germany, a six-day educational program organized by the Goethe Institute in Germany. Thank you, Vismay and Adrita, for running through the specific achievements of the school in various fields. It is said, the way the children have portrayed and shared about their achievements, I am sure they deserve a big hand, and let's, let's do that now. If you want your children to turn out well, Spend twice as much time with them, half as much money. When parents facilitate learning, students are the ultimate winners. I compliment the parents for not only motivating their children to participate and excel, but providing them multifarious platforms outside school. A special mention to all their students who made their mark at the state and national levels include virtuoso golfer Shravan Kadyan, versatile, multi-talented child prodigies Ojasvi Joshi and Kavish, budding writers Barminder Kaur and Athar Watts, fearless karate champion Yashmit Chavla, taekwondo champions Atish Kaushik, 
and Adrit Nandi. Competent lawn tennis player Tapasvi Khatri. Promising swimmer Meera Chauhan. Education for sustainable development aims to provide the knowledge, skills, attitude, and values necessary to address sustainable development challenges. The school took up sustainable development as a theme for the entire year, wherein the students undertook many projects like one mahotsav, making nests out of waste products to rehabilitate birds and many more, which aimed to motivate them to learn and think critically about real world issues and to take action in response to their learning. Today's ballet, Boond, continues this journey as it elaborates about the need of water conservation and restoration. As Helen Keller rightly said, alone we can do so little, together we can do so much. We urge the parents to join hands with a modern family to work relentlessly towards this goal. Enjoy the evening and thank you very much for being here today. Thank you, ma'am, Visme and Adrita for sharing our eventful journey with the August gathering. A charismatic leader inspires and influences people around to be better versions of themselves. We are privileged to have amongst us today Dr. Suman Manjari, retired IPS officer, ex-inspector general of police presently working as a jury member of the Juvenile Justice Board Sonipat, our revered chief guest of the day. In 1988, Dr. Suman Manjri joined the Indian Police Service, Haryana Ketur, as Deputy Superintendent of Police and has held various prestigious appointments. She retired as Inspector General of Police in 2017. Ma'am has held high-profile assignments and has worked relentlessly for crime against women, State Vigilance Bureau, State Crime Record Bureau, as well as being the chairman heading Sexual Harassment Committee of the state. Ma'am has also been awarded with Police Medal for meritorious services along with other eminent awards. Ma'am has played a significant role towards women liberation and specializes in skill development and training. I would now request our revered chief guest of the day, Dr. Suman Manjari, retired IPS officer, to address the August gathering and encourage the students with her enlightening words. तमसो माँ ज्योतिर गमय है एक वेद मंत्र है लेकिन ये वेद मंत्र जब मैं यहाँ आई तब एक मंत्र था अब एक सिद्धांत है सब कुछ है यहाँ पर पूर्णता है 100% marks, 100 से तो ऊपर है ही नहीं। इतने पूर्णता के बाद भी एक विश्वास यहाँ उत्पन्न हो रहा है। एक छोटा सा राई और उसमें एक पतली सी गली और वहाँ मॉडर्न स्कूल मॉडर्न है तो स्कूल तो होगा थॉट ऑफ स्कूल सुने हैं लेकिन जब मैं देख रही थी मुझे लग रहा था मैं शांति निकेतन में बैठी हूं जैसे ही स्पोर्ट्स के सुनना शुरू किया 
मुझे लगा शायद राइस स्पोर्ट्स स्कूल का फंक्शन तो नहीं है ये थोड़ा आगे और चली तो मैं हैरान रह गई कि कहा ऐसी उंगली रखी जाए जहां पूर्णता ना हो आज मेरे बहुत भ्रम टूटे हैं भ्रम टूटने में शायद ये मैं मॉडर्न स्कूल कहू या उसकी जगह में अशोक प्रताप सिंह कह दू तो अतिशोक्ति ना होगी कि दोनों एक ही चीज है मुझे नहीं मालूम कितने पढ़े लिखे इनके माँ बाप थे कितनी सोच रखते थे लेकिन जब नाम दिया होगा तो जरूर कोई ना कोई स्पिरिचुअल टचिंग जरूर आई होगी उन्हें अशोक है तो प्रताप कैसे प्रताप है तो सिंह कैसे और तीनों का सम्मिश्रण है तो वो एक अद्भुत मिलन है और वो जो अद्भुत मिलन है वो यही तो दिख रहा है अनुराधा जी पता नहीं मुझे नहीं लग रहा कि क्यों किस तरह नाम रखा गया होगा राधा ही कह दिया तो अनु कहने की क्या जरूरत थी राधा स्वयं पूर्ण है प्रेम की साकार मूर्ति है लेकिन जब तक अनु नहीं होगा अणु नहीं होगा तो राधा अधूरी है तो यहां पर जब मैंने देखा अशोक है जहां कोई भी किसी तरह की चिंता नहीं दर्द नहीं तो वहां जो बच्चों को वातावरण मिलेगा ज्ञान मिलेगा विवेक मिलेगा परख मिलेगी सहयोग देने की शक्ति मिलेगी तो वो निराली और अद्वितीय तो होगी ही होगी सबसे अधिक मैं ये सोचा करती थी अभी तक पुलिस अधिकारी होने के नाते और ज्वेनाइल जस्टिस बोर्ड में होने के नाते मैंने तो किशोरों को लड़खड़ाते ही देखा है और जब मैं बच्चों की जेल जिसको स्पेशल होम कहते हैं तो जब मैं उसमें जाती हूँ वो भी एक हरियाणा में सोनीपत में ही है सारे हरियाणा में लेकिन आज मैं खुश हूँ कि सोनीपत में यदि वो है तो सोनीपत में मॉडर्न स्कूल भी है कहीं ना कहीं परमात्मा संतुलन रखता है और जब संतुलन होता है तो संतुलन के साथ प्रताप यश तेज ओज तो अपने आप ही आ जाता है और प्रताप में ना तेज है ना ओज है प्रताप शब्द है ही है जो ताप से बना है तप कर बना है उसमें एक संघर्ष है संघर्ष है तो पुरुषार्थ है और पुरुषार्थ है तो सफलता है और सफलता है तो तभी बारह खंबा से जो 1920 22 अक्टूबर को यात्रा शुरू हुई थी तमसो माँ ज्योतिर्गमय की वो पहुंचती पहुंचती जुलाई में 14 और 15 में हमारे सोनीपत स्वर्ण प्रस्थ में आई है हैरान हूं मैं कि शायद पुलिस वाले चप्पा चप्पा जानते हैं इतनी खूबसूरत आत्मा में आज तक नहीं देख पाई थी कि मेरे सोनीपत के अंदर है क्या ज्ञान नहीं दिया जा रहा बच्चों को शुरू में जब मैं आई मुझे लगा अरे मैं तो जूनियर साइंटिस्ट वैज्ञानिकों के बीच में आ गई जब एग्जीबिशन देखी थोड़ी आगे बढ़ी नहीं मुझे लगा नहीं मैं तो पर्यावरण में तो मैं आ गई हूँ थोड़ी आगे बढ़ी मुझे लगा मैं कलाकारों में आ गई हूँ लेकिन समझ में मेरी ट्यूबलाइट तब जली जब मैं बाहर निकली मुझे लगा नहीं जिसने इस संस्था का अवधारणा जिसके मन में उपजी होगी उसने जिस कुम्हार को यहाँ बिठाया है तो कुम्हार जिस तरह कच्चे घड़े को तराश तराश कर एक इतना खूबसूरत घड़ा बना देता है जो शांत भी है ठंडा भी है जल भी देता है गुणकारी भी होता है तो यहाँ पर जितने भी जितने भी शिक्षक हैं वो एक कुम्हार की तरह तो हैं जो कच्चे घड़ों को तराश रहे हैं और उनका तराशा परिणाम मुझे आज देखने को मिल रहा है मैं उन लोगों को बहुत भाग्यशाली समझती हूं कि जिन्होंने अपने बच्चों को यहां भेजा है वो बच्चे बहुत भाग्यशाली हैं कि जो इसके आसपास पास है बृहद दिल्ली जिसको आप दिल्ली एनसीआर कहते हो वहां है तो आपको ऐसा स्कूल मिल गया जहाँ चहुमुखी विकास है वसुधैव कुटुंब की बात है 
सारा वर्ल्ड एक है ये शिक्षा दी जा रही है एक बस मैं यही देख रही थी कि यहां से जो जाएंगे क्योंकि हर स्कूल के ऊपर एक पहचान बन जाती है हम कहते हैं यदि आपको सिविल सर्विसेज में बच्चे को भेजना है तो संस्कृति में करा दीजिएगा हम कहते हैं कि यदि आपको राजनीति में देश चलवाना है बच्चों से तो मेव अजमेर भेज दीजिएगा और हम ये कहते हैं कि यदि आपको बिजनेस में कराना है तो पाथवेज भेज दीजिएगा लेकिन यदि आपको एक सच्चा अच्छा इंसान और जिसमें मानवता के सारे गुण हो और जो सफलता की सीढ़ियों पर चढ़े और एक देश को मोदी जी नहीं बनाएंगे विश्व गुरु यहाँ से ऐसे निकले हुए संस्कारी बच्चे विश्व गुरु बनाएंगे तो अपने बच्चों को मॉडर्न स्कूल में भेज दीजिएगा अब तो मैं ये जन्म तो मेरा पूरा हो गया परमात्मा से मेरी प्रार्थना है कि यदि मुझे मुझे नहीं पता मरने के बाद दोबारा जन्म होता है या नहीं यदि होता हो तो आप में से किसी माँ बाप के गर्भ से पैदा कर देना ताकि मुझे ऐसा स्कूल मिल जाए या मुझे ऐसा पुत्र दे देना जो यहाँ आसपास हो और उसको मैं ऐसे स्कूल में शिक्षा दे पाऊ बहुत मैं निराशावादी हूँ क्योंकि मैं जहां मैंने अपने तीस साल अपने यौवन के दिए हैं मैंने युवकों को किशोरों को जवानों को अपनी जवानी बर्बाद करते देखा है जब मैं जेलों में जाती हूँ छे छे फुट के बच्चे जिनको या तो आर्मी में होना चाहिए था या उनको बंबई जैसे शहर में होना चाहिए था ऐसे मॉडल लगते हैं और जब मुझे लगता है कि कोई तीस साल कोई बीस साल की सजा काट रहा है मैं आजकल इसी इलाके में घूमती हूँ राई ब्लॉक के जितने भी स्कूल है जिसमें बच्चे पांच से लेके चौदह साल तक के हैं उनको पोक्सो के बारे में बताती हूँ कुछ दुख होता है मैं वो माँ बाप को कहना चाहूंगी दिल्ली में अक्सर दिल्ली से ये शुरुआत हुआ था मैं उस कोरोना जो वायरस है वो इतना खतरनाक नहीं है जितना वायरस आज के आधुनिक माँ बाप के दिमाग में है स्कूल में बच्चे के साथ अरे कुम्हार की तरह घड़े को तराशते हैं ये बच्चे के साथ यदि टीचर थोड़ा सा उस बच्चे को डांटती है फटकारती है उल्हाना देती है हड़काती है किसके लिए वो बेहतर इंसान बने उसका रूपांतरण हो और माँ बाप पुलिस थाने आ जाते हैं सो नंबर पर फोन करते हैं और वो पुलिस की हमारी पीसीआर टू टू करती हुई स्कूल में भेजती है शर्म की बात है हम अपने देश के अपनी युवा पीढ़ी को अपने किशोर और बच्चों को कहा लेकर जा रहे हैं स्कूल में तो तराशा ही जाएगा तो सबको सोचना है और मुझे इस बात का भी दुख होता है शायद आप बहुत भाग्यशाली माँ बाप हो भाग्यशाली बच्चे भी हो कि जब पिता आकर मेरे सामने कहता था कि मैडम मेरा बच्चा मेरे कहे में नहीं है सोलह साल का है मोटरसाइकिल घर से पीछे से ले जाता है आप प्लीज चौराहे पे ट्रैफिक वालों को भेज दो और मेरे बच्चे को पकड़वा दो अरे जिस पिता ने जन्म दिया है जिस माँ ने पाल पोस कर बड़ा किया है वो इतने लाचार हो गए हैं लेकिन उसमें यदि हम देखें तो दोष बच्चों का नहीं दोष हमारा है हम उस पीढ़ी का कि हम बच्चों को समय नहीं दे रहे और जो समय दे रहे हैं उसमें शिक्षा नहीं दे रहे यदि शिक्षा भी दे रहे हैं तो दीक्षा नहीं दे रहे और दीक्षा भी दी जा रही है तो जो समाज में आज के दिन थपेड़े खाता हुआ समाज है उससे उसको बचने के तरीके नहीं बताए जा रहे बच्चा जो आप कहते हो वो नहीं करता है जो आप करते हो बच्चा वो करता है ये यहाँ परिवर्तन होगा ही हैरान थी मैं वर्मा जी मेरे को लेकर आ रही थी वहां से जहां हमने चाय पी थी कि चलो मैडम फंक्शन शुरू होने वाला है और मेरी वही पुलिस वाली बुद्धि मैं शॉर्टकट मार के आ रही थी मैडम ने कहा नहीं मैडम शॉर्टकट से नहीं यहाँ यहाँ से चलेंगे तो शॉर्टकट तो बहुत नुकसानदायक है तो जिस स्कूल की मुखिया ऐसी हो जो बच्चों को शॉर्टकट ना सिखा के और हमारे जैसे भी चीफ गेस्ट को भी बताए कि नहीं जहां से रास्ता जाने का बना हुआ है चाहे थोड़ा लंबा है उसी रास्ते से जाना चाहिए तो वहां पे तो मुझे बोलने की आवश्यकता ही नहीं है 
वहां तो जो एक एक संस्कार कोट कोट कर भरा हुआ है ऐसी शिक्षा पहला मैंने स्कूल देखा है अपने तीस वर्षों के अनुभव से कि जहां पर शिक्षा के साथ दीक्षा है मुझे इन्होंने कहा कि चलिए मैडम होस्टल दिखाती हूँ मेरा वही दिमाग कौन रहा था जेनाइल जस्टिस बोर्ड में पोक्सो है बच्चे कैसे सोते होंगे रात को जब वो वार्डन चली जाती होगी तो क्या हरकतें होती होंगी क्योंकि मेरा टेम्परामेंट वो है मैं वो चीजें नहीं देख रही थी मैं कैमरा देख रही थी मैं ये देख रही थी लड़कियों के आने का रास्ता किधर से है लड़कों के आने का रास्ता किधर से है और जब मैंने ये सुना कि जब किशोर यहाँ पर आते हैं तो साथ में मैडम का सुपरविजन रहता है तो मुझे तसल्ली हुई कि इनको जो है जेनाइल जस्टिस बोर्ड में जो हम पोक्सो का ज्ञान देते हैं देने की जरूरत ही नहीं है गुड टच और बैड टच की बात कर रहे थे तो कितने संस्कारी स्कूल हैं आज मैं चीफ गेस्ट को के रूप में आई हूं लेकिन मैं यहां से बहुत कुछ सीख के जा रही हूं परम पिता परमात्मा से मैं उस घड़ी का धन्यवाद करती हूं जिसने मेरा नाम सुझाया होगा कि मैडम को बुला लीजिएगा शायद परमात्मा मुझे सुधारना चाहते थे एक असली भारत और वो भारत जो आत्मा बनेगा वो बच्चे मुझे दिखाना चाहते थे कि नहीं अभी निराश होने की जरूरत नहीं है लगे रहो पुरुषार्थ करो मेहनत करो परिश्रम करो जीवन चाहे संगीत नहीं है संघर्ष तो है लेकिन संघर्ष के लिए यदि हम तत्पर रहेंगे तो जीवन स्वयं संगीतमय हो जाएगा मैं मैनेजमेंट को यहाँ के बच्चों को या उनके पेरेंट्स को और सभी आए हुए महानुभावों को धन्यवाद करती हूँ कि आप लोगों ने मुझे सुना धन्यवाद जय हिंद जय भारत जय हरियाणा जय मॉडर्न स्कूल थैंक यू मैम फॉर योर इंस्पायरिंग वर्ड्स आई रिक्वेस्ट मैम टू काइंडली टेक अ सीट ऑन द स्टेज वर्ड्स फॉल शॉर्ट when we speak about our mentor advisor mr ashok pratap singh former president board of trustees modern school sir's involvement with modern school began in the late 1970s and the modern family has been growing by leaps and bounds under his able mentorship i request mr ashok pratap singh former president board of trustees modern school our mentor and advisor to kindly inspire all with his wise words मंजरी कविता जी लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन जो भी आपने अभी सुना डॉक्टर मंजरी को कहते हुए उसके बाद मेरा कुछ कहना अनुकूल नहीं है लेकिन मैं एक तो चीज डॉक्टर मंजरी को कहना चाहूंगा कि उन्हें अभी कभी कोई जल्दी नहीं है कि दूसरे जन्म देखने की उन्हें बहुत इस जन्म में बहुत कुछ करना है का। और आशा है कि वो करती रहेंगी और ये भी कहना चाहता हूं कि ऐसे चीफ गेस्ट बहुत मुश्किल से मिलते हैं और अगर व्यक्तिगत बात कहूं तो इन्होंने जो कुछ मेरे बारे कहा वो भी बहुत कम चीफ गेस्ट कहते बट नाउ आई वॉन्ट टू टेल यू समथिंग दिस इज समथिंग विच इज कॉल्ड अ स्मार्ट फोन एंड इसमें बहुत सारे छोटे छोटे सर्कल्स uh, हैं जिन्हें के एप्स कहते हैं इस फोन में तीस चालीस ऐसे होंगे मुझे तो 
खाली उनमें से तीन को का प्रयोग करना आता है मेरे बच्चों को दस बारह का आता है और मेरे ग्रैंड चिल्ड्रन को पच्चीस तीस का आता है और वो हर वक्त कोशिश करते हैं मुझे वो सिखाने की और मैं सीखने की कोशिश थोड़ी थोड़ी करता हूं पर मैं उन्हें क्या सिखा सकता हूं सबसे पहले तो ये कि किसी भी समय किसी भी आयु में किसी भी स्थिति में सीखना कभी बंद नहीं होना चाहिए चाहे वो बुजुर्ग हो चाहे वो बच्चे हो हमें सीखने का मौका अवसर हमेशा प्राप्त होता है लेकिन हमारे ऊपर है कि हम उसे खींच लें और सीख लें और दूसरी चीज मैं क्या सिखा सकता हूँ बच्चों को मैं क्या कह सकता हूँ यही कि अच्छे मनुष्य बनो बिकम अ जेंटलमैन बिकम अ पर्सन विद कर्टसी बिकम अ पर्सन विद कॉम्पैशन बिकम अ पर्सन हु नोज हाउ टू रिस्पेक्ट ऑल दोज अराउंड यू how to maintain their dignity and how to have the ability to be good for yourself good for all those around you good for the country and this totality of learning on the on the one side the new things which are which are changing so fast digitally i just told you something but there are so many developments and the world is changing so fast and at the same time jo maine abhi cheeze kahi unko ek shabd mein agar kaha jaye to wo hai sanskar and jaise aapne dekha जैसे आपने सुना मॉडर्न स्कूल इन दोनों चीजों का मिश्रण करता है करता रहेगा एंड इट इज विद दैट थॉट आई अर्ज यू ऑल टू गिव थॉट टू व्हाट द चीफ गेस्ट सेड टू यू because in it was contained all the learning that in this short gathering we can look for thank you very much thank you sir for your wise words i request sir to kindly take a seat on the stage if you think you are beaten you are if you think that you dare not you don't if you would like to win but you think you can't it's almost certain that you won't it's all in the state of mind you've got to think high to rise because life's battles don't always go to the stronger or faster man but sooner or later the man who wins is the man who thinks he can it's the time now to honor our achievers through a prize distribution ceremony who succeeded and triumphed because they thought they can I request our respected headmistress ma'am Ms Rimpi Verma to announce the names of the students for their noteworthy performances throughout the year. I humbly request our ever chief guest of the day Dr Suman Manjuri, Mr Ashok Pratap Singh mentor advisor to kindly give away the prizes to the deserving students under the category of scholastic and co-scholastic awards. Namaskar good evening ladies and gentlemen. a momentous day of celebrations an annual awards ceremony 
I request our Honorable Chief Guest, Dr. Suman Manjuri, escorted by the Principal, to give away the annual awards of the category Principal's Appreciation and All Rounder. The first category of awards is Principal's Appreciation Award, which goes to Pulkit Verma of Class S7, a gifted singer, winner of various inter school events. Excellent in academics, a very disciplined and self-motivated child. Ladies and gentlemen, a huge round of applause for the parents who have come to receive the award. Next in line is Japkirat Singh of Class S7, an ardent guitarist. He's won Best Delicate Award in MUNs, has a focused approach and excellent in academics. We see his mother receiving the award. A huge round of applause for her. The next category of awards is the All-Rounder Awards, which are backed by Kavish of Class P4, a good orator, Prefect of the school, national level skating champion, winner of various inter-school events, Guinea's world record holder, and excellent in academics. Now we have Mehran Seni of Class P4, a budding artist, taekwondo champion, junior house captain, winner of various inter-school events, and again, excellent in academics. We cannot hear the round of applause. Children have achieved so much. Yashni Chavla of Class P5, National Karate Champion, Creative Artist, won many karate championships, inter school events, a versatile go getter. Now we have Barminda Kaur of Class P5, a confident speaker. She has won many inter school events at various levels in different fields, won a worldwide event in Redo, and her work was published in the book Paul Star, was awarded with the world's youngest editor at a worldwide event. Next we have Arya Chauhan of Class S1, a disciplined student who is excellent in academics, good orator who participated in various debates and declamations, rank holder in various Olympiads and winner of many inter-school events. He's also actively participated in sports. He plays basketball and chess. Varini Padar of Class S2, excellent public speaker who participated in various debates and inter-school events, excellent in academics, a disciplined and goal-oriented child who takes keen interest in sports and co-curricular activities. Ujaswi Joshi of Class S2, an international world record holder who has performed in more than 400 stage shows and received 350 trophies, certificates and cash prizes. She's an excellent orator who's very good at sports as well, being excellent in academics. She's a disciplined and talented, confident child who's a brand ambassador of Beti Bachao, Beti Padao campaign. Jasmine Kaur of Class S3, an outstanding singer, an excellent performer who has won various inter-school music competitions. She takes keen interest in cricket too and is doing very well in academics. Adil Shamim of Class S5, excellent in academics again, has received special mention in MUNs, participated and won various curricular, co-curricular and inter-school events. He takes keen interest in sports as well. Trisha Ghai of Class S5, again an excellent orator, takes immense interest in theatre and co-curricular activities. She is the house captain of the school, who has won the best delicate award in MUN, best speaker award in Hindi debate, and runners-up award in relay race on annual sports day. 
Bhumika Agarwal, excellent in academics, is absent today, but we would like to read. Co-author of two books, has won various intra and inter-school literary and academic competitions. A compassionate social worker, excellent writer, stood second in Haryana State School Games Development Foundation, former house captain of the school as well. Ladies and gentlemen, she's absent, but let us give her a round of applause. Yashri Mishra of class S6, an outstanding singer who takes equal interest in basketball and taekwondo, excellent in academics. She's a former cultural prefect who's also served as the admin director of the Interact Club. She's also participated in various inter-school events. Proud of you. Thank you, ma'am, for felicitating the students. Now I invite Mr. Ashok Pratap Singh, escorted by Abba Ma'am, to give away the prizes to the next set of deserving students. The next category of awards is Excellence in Academics goes to Kabir Gupta of Class P3. Excellence in Academics! Sherwin Gupta of class P4. Harbir Singh Sandhu of class P5. Arya Chauhan of class S1. Varini Podar of class S2. Shaurya Garg of class S3. Ayushman Chandel of class S4. Adil Shamim of class S5. Trisha Ghai of class S5. Trisha Ghai of class S5. Yajat Pahuja of class S6. Japkirat Singh of class S7. The mother is here to receive the award. Japkirat Singh, not only excellent in academics but in music too. Pulkit Verma of class S7. The father is here to receive the award. A moment of great pride for him and for us. Rudransh Vivedi of class S7.
Aro Banerjee of class S7. He's absent today. Mana Varoda of class S7. Mother of Mana Varoda, ladies and gentlemen, is here to receive the award. Jab Kirat Singh again of class 7, S7 for securing 100% marks in psychology. Mana Varoda also was for 100% marks in business studies. Excellence in Information and Communication Technology Awards. Ladies and gentlemen, they go to Divyansh Sajdeva of Class P3. And Arya Chauhan of Class S1. Arya Chauhan of Class S1. The next category of awards is Excellence in Dance. It goes to Adya Khattar of Class S3. Adya Khattar of Class S3. And Adrita Nandi of Class S5. Excellence in vocal music. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Jasmine Kaur of class S3, who brightened our sports day with her excellent performances. Excellence in instrumental music goes to Harshit Grover of class S3. And Arav Ghai of class S6, the guitarist and the drummer. Arav Ghai, we saw him perform today. Excellence in artwork goes to Aryaman Mehta of class P5. And Ayushman Kurana of class S1. The next category of awards is Excellence in Sports. The first young achiever is Yashmi Chavla of class S1. For Karate, National Achiever and Silver Medalist. The next one is Kavish of Class P4, National Level Participant Skating. Sharanya of class S6, national level participant. She's absent today, but she has been actively participating in, skate, participating in skating. Shravan Kadyan of class S6. We take pride in telling you that he's a national level participant golf. Ashita Huda of class P1, excellence in sports, state level participant, skating.
Shreya Parmar, Class P1C, Excellence in Sports Skating, State Level Participant. <laughs> She's been taught to do so. <laughs> Anna Huda, Class P2, State Level Participant, Skating. Udjati Agarwal, Class S4, State Achiever, Silver Medalist, Skating. Mishka Garg, Class S3, State Achiever, Bronze Medalist, Skating. Last but not the least, the final category of awards is Scholarship Awards, which go to Rudransh Duvedi, Topper of Science Stream in CBSE Board Exams, being awarded with a cash prize of rupees 21,000. Pulkit Verma, Topper of Commerce Stream in CBSE Board Exams, being awarded a cash prize of rupees 21,000. The father is here. Jab Kirat Singh, Topper of Humanity Stream, CBSE Board Exams, being awarded a cash prize of Rs. 21,000. The students who scored above 90% in Class 10 CBSE Board Exams are being awarded with scholarships now. Adil Shamim. He's been awarded scholarship for class 10th result. The applause should be loud, louder. Trisha Ghai. Rishika Goyal. Palak Tushir, Raghav Agarwal, Palak Tushir, Raghav Agarwal, all dressed up for the play. Aditya Kapoor, Diyuksha Chauhan, Bhavya Jain. Prakhar Srivastav, he's absent, Dhruvan Agarwal, Dhruvan Agarwal, okay, students who scored above 90% in class 8 are being awarded rupees 20,000 in scholarship, Dhruvan, are you in the crowd there, Dhruvan Agarwal? Okay, so when he comes, we will award him. Is he here? Dhruvan is here for class 10th result. Above 90%. Students who scored above 90% in class 8 are being awarded Rs. 20,000 in scholarship. 
The first one is Sana Afreen. Sahil Shamim. Sahil Shamim. Mishka Garg. Aira Dalpatya. Arnav Jain. Arsh Gupta, a final young achiever of the day, Arnav Jain, Arsh Gupta. Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, ma'am. Now I request our Venerable Principal Ma'am to kindly escort our guests. I request Rimpi Ma'am to go along with the guests. A school magazine reflects the identity of a school. It celebrates the journey of experiences and achievements of the students. Ladies and gentlemen, we present before you Prayas, an endeavor to showcase all that the school has achieved over the year. May I humbly request our eminent guest, Dr. Suman Manjri, Retired IPS officer, ex Inspector General of Police, Mr. Ashok Pratap Singh, sir, advisory and former president, Board of Trustee, Modern School, Ms. Anuradha Singh, president, Board of Trustee, Modern School, our distinguished trustee, Mr. Sanjay Garg, and guest of honor, Ms. Kavita. Renowned Odissi dancer to be present for the unveiling of school magazine prayers. I request the principal, ma'am, Miss Abba Sadana, to be present with them. I now request the chief editor of prayers, Miss Sarika, to be present there for the ceremony. I now request Ms. Anuradha Singh, President, Board of Trustees, Modern School, to unveil the prayers, the school magazine for the session 2022-23. School magazine gives information of various events, astonishing achievements, mesmerizing memories, activities, competition, and workshops organized all around the year. It also unfolds the splendid talent of the students in academics, sport, art, and craft. It serves like a yearbook. A stellar compilation of all that our students have learned, explored and achieved. A symbol of pride and a miniature representation of the school. Through this magazine, the journey of industrious modernites is being unveiled. I thank all the guests. 
we request our dearest headmistress ma'am miss rimpi verma to present the vote of thanks namaskar and a very good evening again a span of more than 2 years in the confines it is a matter of pride to see our students celebrating together and delving in its spirit no duty is more urgent than that of returning thanks i dream it as a great honor and privilege to propose a vote of thanks to our honorable chief guest ips retired dr suman manjri a guest to foreigner kavita dwibedi ji whose presence is a source of great encouragement for everyone your visit shall be a treasure trove of cherished memories for us thank you for coming we truly blessed and motivated by the presence of mr ashok pratap singh our mentor our advisor former president board of trustees modern school we thank him for taking out time to attend the event we elated to have mrs anuradha singh president board of trustees modern school with us today we thank her for her unstinting support and presence a profound regards and heartfelt gratitude to the promoters and trustees of pet principals of various institutions the assembly of distinguished guests parents and dignitaries for taking out time to attend the event acknowledge and thank all the teachers who worked hard for the success of the event I think it is befitting to mention the incredible support rendered by the support staff all the dds and bhaiyas present and you can see them working today their diligent efforts were remarkable even during the practice sessions the admin team for playing a pivotal role in organizing the event we owe our thanks to parent fraternity who joined us today who've always extended their cooperation and support they are present today to witness our students perform excellently on the stage last but not the least i thank my little adorable students who worked so hard to put up the show that gives out a beautiful message save water save life i hope you all enjoy the presentation today Thank you once again namaskar and a very very good evening Thank you ma'am Water is the elixir of life Each drop of water is precious It's a boon a treasure endowed upon us from the brink of heaven a blessing to be cherished and conserved Its journey to earth in itself is magical and mesmerizing a miracle that sustains life we welcome you all to this exhilarating odyssey of a drop of water a life main ek boond hu mujhse hi is srishti ki rachna hui hai main badlon ki god mein rehti hu varsha ke mausam mein main dharti par aati hu उस पहली बूंद को देखकर मनुष्य प्रसन्न हो जाता है मुझे वास्तव में गर्व है कि मैं किसी प्यासे की प्यास बुझाती हूं कितना लंबा है मेरा सफर कभी सोचा है बहुत सारी बूंदें आसमान से धरती के लिए एक साथ चली राहें तो सबकी एक ही थी मंजिल भी सबने एक ही सोची मगर हुआ यूं धरती पर आते आते सबकी मंजिल अलग हो गई कुछ आकर वृक्षों की बाहों में झूल गईं, कुछ गंगा की पवित्रता में घुलकर सुंदर सलोनी हो गईं, कुछ तालाब के ठहरे पानी के साथ ठहरी ही रह गईं, कुछ मिट्टी में मिलकर सांसों में खुशबू घोल गईं, कुछ फूलों के लप पर कविता बोल गईं, कुछ बूंदे सागर में गिर 
मोती बन इतराने लगी मॉडर्न स्कूल के छात्र छात्राएं आपके समक्ष प्रस्तुत करते हैं बूंदों के सफर की एक कहानी मत करो इस सफर को खत्म करने की नादानी जब सौर मंडल में केवल सूर्य था तो पानी का कोई अस्तित्व नहीं था उसके बाद हाइड्रोजन और ऑक्सीजन के मिलने से पानी का निर्माण हुआ था अपने जन्म के करोड़ों वर्षों तक पृथ्वी बहुत गर्म थी तब पानी जलवाष्प के रूप में था
शिव जी के कैशो से गंगा मैया रहती जा जो भी मन से उनको जाए जो भी मन से उनको जाए कब से मुक्ति बूंद पानी के खातिर दर दर ठोकर खाते हैं हमें बताओ कौन रास्ते गंगा तट को जाते हैं मेरे कमंडल में है पानी की एक बूंद एक बूंद गर्म तवे पर गिरे तो भाप बन जाए सीप पर गिरे तो मोती बन जाए प्यासे को मिल जाए तो अमृत बन जाए अमृत बन जाए अमृत बन जाए सारी बूंदें आसमान से धरती के लिए एक साथ चली राहें तो सब की एक ही थी मंजिल भी सबने एक ही सोची मगर हुआ यू धरती पर आते आते सब की मंजिल अलग हो गई कुछ आकर दरख्तों की बाहों में झूल गई कुछ दरिया से मिलकर अपना आप ही भूल गई कुछ गंदे पानी के नाले में गिरकर मैली कुचैली हो गई कुछ गंगा की पवित्रता में धुलकर सुंदर हो गई सारे सारी धानी धापा गरे गरे कुछ तालाब में ठहरे पानी संग ठहरी ही रह गई ठहरी ही रह गई कुछ बहती नदियों संग बहकर सागर में जा मिल गई कुछ मिट्टी में घुलकर सांसों में खुशबू सी घोल गई कुछ फूलों के लब पर बारिश की कविता बोल गई
मैं हूँ पानी की एक बूंद कितना लंबा है मेरा सफर कभी सोचा है जल संकट से जूझ रहे दुनिया के 400 शहरों में शीश 20 शहरों में चार शहर भारत में ही हैं चेन्नई पहले कोलकाता दूसरे मुंबई ग्यारहवें दिल्ली पंद्रहवें नंबर पर है जल संकट के मामले में चेन्नई और दिल्ली जल्द ही दक्षिण अफ्रीका का केप टाउन शहर बनने की राह में हैं। देश के 400 प्रतिशत से अधिक क्षेत्रों में सूखे का संकट है भारत सरकार ने वर्ष 2019 में जल संकट से निपटने के लिए जल शक्ति मंत्रालय बनाया बड़े बड़े सेमिनार कहानी लेखों का आंकलन ही करते रह जाओगे इस धरती से मेरे जाने के बाद मेरी कीमत समझ पाओगे
मत गिराओ बेटा इत्तेफाक रखो पानी की कहानी से जीवन निकला था पानी से बर्बाद न हो बर्बाद न हो थोड़ा भी कभी नहीं मिलता आसानी से जब मैं तुम्हारी तरह छोटी थी ना कल कल स्वच्छ नदियों और झरनों में खेला करती थी वाह क्या दिन थे निर्मल स्वच्छ जल हर तरफ निर्मल स्वच्छ जल
पानी में अक्स देखकर खुश हो रही थी मैं पानी में अक्स देखकर खुश हो रही थी मैं पत्थर किसी ने फेंक कर मंजर बदल दिया ओ, मेरी नाव देखो देखो <laughs> अरे खाने के लिए नहाने के लिए और तुम्हारी इस कागज की नाव को तैराने के लिए भी पानी ही चाहिए समझे पानी टिकेगा तो संस्कृति टिकेगी पानी की रवानी असल में जीवन की गतिशीलता का उदाहरण है दुनिया की सभी संस्कृतियों का उद्गम पानी के अस्तित्व से ही जुड़ा हुआ है पूरे संसार में बूंदों के पानी ने रची एक कहानी है जिसमें राजा न रानी है सिर्फ पानी ही पानी है और को 
अम्मा जरा देख तो ऊपर चले आ रहे हैं बादल गरज रहा है बरस रहा है दिख रहा है जल ही जल जल ही जल सीने की कमाई हूं नदी बोली समंदर से मैं तेरे पास आई हूं Vamos a llamarla. 
दादी को नहीं जानत कासे कहूँ कासे कहूँ कासे कहूँ जिया की बी जिया की बी जल और समय का महत्व बस उन्हें ही पता चलता है जो इसे अपनी नादानियों की वजह से खो देते हैं और फिर पछताते हैं जिस तरह पत्थर पर लगातार गिरती पानी की बूंदें उसमें छेद कर देती हैं उसी तरह मानव भी छोटे छोटे प्रयासों से बड़े लक्ष्य हासिल कर सकता है मुझे आशा है कि एक शिक्षित और जागरूक नागरिक होने के नाते राष्ट्रीय और अंतर्राष्ट्रीय स्तर पर हम सब पानी की एक एक बूंद को बचाकर इस अभियान को सफल बनाएंगे जल ही जीवन है जल ही जीवन है जल ही जीवन है जल ही जीवन है समझ गए समझ गए हम समझ गए हम समझ गए पानी का मोर हम समझ गए जल से है जीवन जीवन से जल अधमो इसे बचाओ इसे संभालो यू न करो सफाई 
इस कचरे की इस कचरे ने जीना किया मुहा हर जोर लगा के ऐसा हर दम लगा के ऐसा जरा सबको मिला के ऐसा जरा हाथ बढ़ा के ऐसा हर जोर लगा के ऐसा हर दम लगा के ऐसा जरा सबको मिला के ऐसा जरा हाथ बढ़ा के ऐसा हो चलो चलो कचरा उठाने चलो 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 सब चलो चलो देश बचाने चलो चलो सुनो आज नहीं बचा पाए तो कल आंखों से नीर बहाओगे ख्यालों में ही मुझे पाओगे ख्यालों में ही मुझे पाओगे ख्यालों में ही मुझे पाओगे मैं जल हूँ मैं जल हूँ मैं ही तुम्हारा कल हूँ मैं ही तुम्हारा कल हूँ आने वाला मैं तुम्हें बचाऊंगी मेरे दोस्त मैं तुम्हें बचाऊंगी हम तुम्हें बचाएंगे हम सब तुम्हें बचाएंगे मेरे दोस्त हम सब तुम्हें बचाएंगे सारा संसार 
चलो मुझे बचा लो मुझे कल मेरी तस्वीर हो ना हो ये जल हो ना हो ये जल हो ना हो आने वाला कल हाथों में तेरे उसे बचा ले उसे बचा ले उसे बचाले वॉटर इज एट द कोर ऑफ सस्टेनेबल डेवलपमेंट whether it be saving soil trees or waste management we at modern embrace and follow sustainable development goals as an intrinsic part of our learning environment modernites as interactors strive to lead campaigns and help conserve our nature preserve our mother earth so i urge all of you to come together and take a pledge to save water save life Thank you, everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, we leave you with a message this evening: Save water, save life. Please put your hands together for the team who toiled day and night to prepare this presentation. Event coordination: Ms. Ritu Sharma, Ms. Sonia Goswami. Choreography, set, lyrics, and script. Miss Tripti Sanwal. Costume, Miss Tripti Sanwal and Miss Pranamika. Music direction, Mr. Jitendra Singh Jamwal. Prop coordinator, Miss Preeti. Stage properties and props, Miss Mini, Miss Akanksha Goel, Miss Sheenam. Choir, Miss Pranamika. Orchestra and Vanna music composer Mr. Vishwajit. Prayas Ms. Sarika and Ms. Nupur. For technical support, we thank Ms. Shikha and Mr. Yash. And our guiding light, the Honorable Principal Ms. Abha Sadana and Headmistress Ms. Rimpi Verma. We thank Ms. Isha, Ms. Mikram Chikara, Mr. S. K. Mishra for logistics. A sincere thanks to all those without whom this presentation would not have been possible. I request all the honourable guests to kindly be near the stage for a group photograph. Our chief guest of the day, Dr. Suman Manjri. A guest of honour, Ms. Kavita Dwivedi, Mr. Ashok Pratap Singh, Ms. Anuradha Singh, Mr. Sanjay Gar. Dear audience, a big round of applause for all the participants and the team. As they spread mirth and colour and spread the message of save water, save life. Last but not the least, we thank all the parents for their constant support and cooperation towards the school. We hope everyone will come together and lend a hand to this movement to save water, to save life on this earth.
Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, sir. I request all the parents to kindly be seated till the guests leave the ground. We request all the parents to kindly abide by the following pointers for the dispersal. It is requested that only one parent goes to pick up the ward from the respective venues to avoid chaos in the corridors. The dispersal venues have been mentioned for your convenience on the board. Kindly sign and inform the teacher in charge before picking the ward and leaving the school premises. I also request all the parents to kindly visit the exhibition which is open for all the parents. We thank everyone who consented to be here to spend this beautiful evening with us. The participants will leave the stage group-wise, one group at a time. All the parents are requested to visit the exhibition. Parents are requested to kindly visit the exhibition. It will take students some time as they will return the jewellery and accessories and then only you will be able to take your awards. Kindly sign and then pick up your award from the disposal venue.